Let's walk through adding a new property to each type of object. So we have name, seats, food. Let's go ahead and create a booked property to say how many seats are currently booked. So to do that, we could come here, we could do booked, and we just do 25, comma, and just to save some time for ourselves as well, we do the same thing here. So it's relatively quick. All right, that's fine. And when we come here, we can just do this. Whoop, let's actually do it right below seats. And then we just add in booked as a parameter. Then all we'd have to do is we could change actually the same exact values. 15, 25, 15, and 25. Now that took roughly the same amount of time, but here's the thing, there's only three objects here. If you had to change hundreds of objects, or thousands, or millions, it would take forever to go through one by one and change it this way. So instead it would actually be much easier for you uh, to actually go through and just change the one original constructor object. And then you could just go through and just change the values in here. So once you just make that change, you just come in and just change one value, as opposed to having to scroll through thousands or millions of lines of code. So you can see it just makes it that much easier.